a game with a cause. That was the message for a Bishop Fian hockey game tonight as they played in honor of fellow player A.J. Quetta. A.J. suffered a spinal injury on Tuesday night on the ice. His family, friends, and even the Boston Bruins have chipped in to help A.J. and his family through this difficult time. And today, his family on the ice played for his recovery. 12 News reporter Sheena Lasciuto is outside tonight's game. She joins us now live with more. Sheena. Yeah, Mike, the way you said it really just captures it best. Tonight was all about AJ and his hockey family. We also heard from his sisters who say they're just grateful for all of the support so far. At moments like this, it doesn't matter what jersey you're wearing or who you play for. The hockey world comes together. There's one less pair of skates on the ice Friday night as Bishop Fiend hockey player AJ Quetta continues to recover from a serious injury. He was rushed to the hospital Tuesday during a game in Springfield after crashing into the boards. This is the first time his team has played since. Before puck drop, both hockey teams, Bishop Fian and Austin Prep, came together to pray for AJ. His jersey hanging above the ice, along with an AJ's Army banner. The teams may be opponents when the clock starts, but right now they're rooting for Quetta. These are AJ's sisters. They say they are thankful for all of the support. The GoFundMe organized for the North Providence teenager has already surpassed $600,000. And this story continues to catch the eye of those in the hockey community, including the Boston Bruins. Of course, this season might be challenging, but nothing like what this AJ kid's going through. At Thursday night's game at the Garden, the Shamrocks player was awarded the game puck. So, game puck's going to AJ. And back in Attleboro, at the conclusion of Friday night's game, the teams once again met at center ice to pray for AJ. And really, every time we refresh that GoFundMe page, the number gets higher and higher. Now, we weren't actually allowed inside the ice rink tonight due to COVID-19 restrictions, so a lot of that video you just saw was sent to us by Bishop Bean High School. I'm Sheena Loshuto, 12 News.